The Bobcat basketball team finished up the 2011 portion of the schedule right on cue in what has been a wildly successful year for Ohio athletics by beating Kennesaw State Friday night 71 to 63. But the wind is summed up with a single word, ugly. Coming off a week long stretch of no games, the Bobcats certainly weren't their sharpest in a sloppy first half that saw 17 total turnovers. Ohio shot just 45% from the field and had only 27 first half points, leading by the skinniest of margins, 27. 726 heading into the break. Second half, Ohio, led by three-point marksman Nick Kellogg, erupted out of the gates with back-to-back -back Kellogg threes and would swell their lead to seven by the first media timeout. But like a bad cold, the Owls of Kennesaw State wouldn't go away. Eight straight points from Owls guard Delbert Love brought KSU back, tying the game at 42 with just over 12 minutes remaining. But like good teams do, Ohio responded big. A 19-5 back-breaking run sent the Owls back south for the winner as Ohio never looked back on their way to their 12th win of the season, tying the program's best mark in school history with a 12-1 start to the season. No surprise, four players hit double figures in scoring, led by Walter Off at 17. Next up, though, for Ohio, a Monday night test with Robert Morris right back in the convo at 7 o'clock. We'll see you then. For the Bobcat Sports Showcase, I'm Blake Brody.